that this week, I migrated my WordPress blog over to the Show It platform. And I documented all the steps so that I can show you exactly how to do it as well. Let's get started. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. I'm Maureen from thecreativeimpact.com, where I help creative entrepreneurs, coaches, and bloggers with strategic show at website design, templates, and business trainings so that they can stand out, sell more, and stress way less about the design and tech in their business, and therefore they can serve their audience better. If this sounds like information that you are interested in, then hit that subscribe button right now so you don't miss any of the videos I post on this channel each and every week. Okay, first let me say that if you are thinking about moving your blog to show it, but you're worried about how the transfer to the platform will go, don't be. In my experience, the whole process was seamless. Show It does recommend backing up your blog before starting the process just in case, but if you are used to WordPress headaches and bad customer support from your hosting company, you are in for an absolute treat. The Show It support team they're amazing. It's like no other support team that I've ever worked with. And they helped me through the entire process to make sure everything went smoothly. Now, if you happen to be wondering why a WordPress lover like me moved her WordPress blog and site over to the show up platform, check out the video above and then come back here for the step-by-step -step blog migration process. Okay, let's get into this. So this tutorial is showing you how to move your blog over to the Show It platform, specifically your WordPress blog to the Show It platform so that your website and blog can be hosted in the same place. You will still write your blog post in WordPress, but your page where all your blog posts will show up, also known as your blog role, will now be on Show It. And if you end up purchasing a Show It website template from me, this page will already be set up for you. So you don't even have to worry about that. So the first thing that you need to do in order to migrate your blog is make sure you're on the right show up plan. So the basic show up plan does not include a blog, okay? You don't have any type of migration or anything with this basic plan. So if you have a blog right now that you wanna migrate, you need either need to choose from the show it plus basic blog or the show it plus advanced blog. And let me break that down a little bit for you. So the Show It Plus Basic blog is the best choice if you want to start a new blog or you have less than 50 blog posts from WordPress or Squarespace that you want to migrate over. It will include in the migration pre-installed plugins. So let me show you what those plugins include. So when migrating over from WordPress, uh, I believe it's right down here, these right here are the plugins that are going to come with your basic show it subscription. So if this is enough for you then, and you have less than 50 posts, then, then you want to choose that, uh, the show it plus basic block plan. You could read through this a little bit more about what's included, but if you have more than 50 blog posts or you want to install custom plugins, then you're going to need the Show It Plus Advanced blog. And this is the one I have my subscription to with Show It uh, because I wanted to install some of my own custom plugins. I use things like Pretty Links and Lead Pages. So those types of things I wanted to have the custom plugins for. So I went with the advanced blog. Again, read these over to see what will be best for you. Both the plans do include that free blog migration. The advanced migration comes with you know the plugins where the simple blog migration on the basic plan does not come with the custom plugins. That's pretty much the difference. Okay, so here I am just in one of my templates. Let's pretend you've taken this whole template, you've designed it how you want, and now you're ready to transfer your WordPress blog over to the show up platform. So what we're gonna do would be to come up to site settings and we're gonna click on that. And then right here, you're gonna see something that says custom domain. It'll say domain not set. We're gonna click edit. Now, mine looks a little different because this template is already associated with the creativeimpact.com. But when you click on edit, what you're going to see is this right here. 
it is going to ask you to add a domain and you're just going to click the blue button to get started. And the next thing it's going to ask you is, do you own a domain name? And if you already have your blog up, then the answer is going to be yes. And you're going to enter the domain name where you're transferring your blog from. And you're going to click next. Now on this page, you're just going to click all the little dots that apply. So do you currently have a website up at your domain? You click that. How was your existing website built? Was it a custom site built by you or a designer or a template-based site, pre-built, Squarespace? So choose the one that applies to you. And then you want to make sure that you definitely check, I currently have a blog at this domain if you're looking to migrate your blog over to show it. Then you're going to click next. All right, then you're going to be asked to confirm your information, make sure your domain name looks right, the things that you indicated on the last box are correct, and then you're going to provide your phone number here and any additional information. And don't worry about putting your phone number. Um, no one has contacted me from show it. I'm not getting spammed in any way. I think it's just for an emergency if they can't reach you in another way. And then once you do that, you're going to click submit. Okay, and then from there, you get this message success. Your domain information has been successfully saved and show it. Your subscription includes a blog. Are you ready to set up your blog now? So you need to choose whether or not you wanna set up your blog now or wait. I recommend you wait to transfer your blog until you have customized your show it template and you're pretty much ready to go. So then you can just set up your blog and site at the same time and be ready to go live. So when you are ready, you're going to click this blue button that says, yes, proceed to the blog setup. From here, you're going to choose your blog setup type. Are you setting up a new blog? Are you migrating your existing blog? This tutorial is showing you how to migrate your existing blog. So you're going to click that second button and click next. Okay, this screen is just showing you what your blog domain is. And when you set it up, it's going to be available at this domain. So if it looks correct, you can click next. Okay, now you need to give show it your current blog domain URL. So what you want to do is just open up your current blog, wherever it is, and copy the URL directly from the browser and paste it in here. That way you'll have either the HTTP or the HTTPS, depending on what you have, um, copy it and paste it in right here and click next. Here, you're going to provide show it with your current blog login information and definitely double check that you provide the right login credentials. This will speed up the process. If everything looks good, they won't have to contact you to get a different email address or password or any of that stuff. So double check that this is all right and click verify. Okay, now we're talking about publishing timing. So when do we want this site to go live? We need to let show it know. So it can be, we can click yes, complete the setup and activate my show it website. If our, our show it website template is done and ready to go and we have our blog, we're ready to go live. If not, you can click no and then just contact the show it team and, and let them know when you're ready to launch. And within your show it, you have that little uh, message button on the side, they are uh, amazing support. So you can just email them or send them a little message with the um, on the site and then they will guide you through the setup process from there. If you're clicking yes, you're gonna get to the next window, which is blog setup. You can give them any additional information that you wanna give them. And they're just letting you know that the new blog setup is not immediate. It does take a little bit of time. Mine only took a few hours. I guess it depends on the day or how much, how many blogs they're working with, but you can click the link there that says learn more about estimated turnaround times if you have any concerns. Once you enter any additional information, if any, you're going to click submit. And then you're going to get a message like this saying your migration request has been received. Once your blog is set up, we will contact you with instructions to point your domain name to your new blog server. Soon after you submit your migration, again, depending on the turnaround times for that day, you should be getting an email from Show It that says that your blog is set up and is ready on our servers. The last thing you need to do to finalize the process and to get your site secure is that you need to update your domain's DNS records. So this is where a little bit of tech is involved, but you can contact your hosting provider to do this for you. That's exactly what I did. So my WordPress blog was hosted through Bluehost. So I contacted Bluehost support if it's hosted through GoDaddy 
or site ground or something like that, you're just going to contact their support and you're going to give them this information right here. It's blurred out in this video because these are mine, but these are the DNS records that um, need to, you need to have these things pointed to show it now. So your hosting company can do this for you. They just take care of it. And I, I just contacted Bluehost. I gave them this information and they changed it over for me. And then once it was done, I just responded to this email and let them know that it was done. And then within the hour, my site and blog were completely live on the Show It platform. And now here is my new site. Everything is up and running. I have my blog here. So when you click on it, every all my posts got just seamlessly transferred into here. So this is my new blog role. And now when I want to blog, all I have to do is go to the creative impact forward slash. I'm still, my blog is still in WordPress, it's just host it with show it now. So I still go to the creativeimpact.com forward slash WP dash admin. And now you can see, I not only have this WordPress, it says create it with show it. I log in with the same information and I go about writing my blog post the same way. But once I publish them, they're going to show up on my show it blog roll, which is right here. And there you go, that's the entire process. You now know how to move your blog to the Show Up platform step-by-step. Step. Hit the like button if you found this tutorial helpful. And if you want to move your blog to Show It and you need a professionally designed website template to make setting up a stunning and strategic website so much simpler, like no need to design from scratch here, guys. Get on the wait list for my new Show It template shop coming in mid-October 2022. These templates will be plug and play pre-made full website templates created by me that will include step-by-step -step video tutorials and will allow you to get your site up and running in days, not months. You're also going to get exclusive updates and sneak peeks of what I'm working on. And you might even get a chance to get the templates early and at a special discount. So get on the wait list now by going to thecreativeimpact.com forward slash template wait list. Or if you are watching this video after October 2022, go to the show notes below, right at the top, check out the link for my template shop so you can check out the templates I have. I'll see you next time, guys. Bye.